What can you do to minimize worry in a world that's filled with chaos? Pictures taken by Gallery of Hope Nature Photography. Think about if the power goes out or there's a natural disaster, what items would I need? Then work within your financial means to purchase the items as you can to avoid debt. Put aside an emergency fund so you have cash on hand, even if it's only $5 a month. Learn about wilderness survival. Take a class, buy a book or more, or watch YouTube videos on survival. Learn CPR and first aid. Put together a first aid kit or purchase one. Get extra groceries when you go shopping, even if just one canned food item or bottled water. If it helps you feel more secure, keep a bag or container by your bed with a flashlight and batteries, taser, or pepper spray. If you have little kids, make sure to keep these items in a spot away from child access. Get in shape as much as possible. If exercise isn't your thing, dance to music, walk, find out what physical activities you like, and do them. If you have pets, create an emergency pet bag to keep close by your bed with food, water, and needed pet supplies. If your pet is small and sleeps in your room, keep a carrier by your bed as well. Start a garden. Even if it's just seeds in a container by the window, on a patio, or apartment balcony. Keep a backpack or bag by your bed with a change of clothes, socks, shoes, ID, spare keys, flashlight, batteries, etc. Take each day one at a time. I like this verse. Don't worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will bring worries of its own. Today's trouble is enough for today. Matthew 6, 34. Know what's going on in the world, but don't spend hours a day watching news. This includes news on sites like YouTube, Twitter, etc. Purchase a home security system or increase home safety. A cheaper option is to use sliding door and window locks. They are easy to install and no tools are needed. Talk to trusted friends, family, or neighbors about preparing together. Watch funny videos of kittens, cats, dogs, or whatever makes you laugh. We all need humor and joy. Make an emergency preparedness bag. Keep it hidden by a door or in a vehicle. This bag should have items like water, food, medicine, weather radio, first aid kit, multi-tool, flashlight, documents, personal items, emergency blanket, money, cell phone charger, maps, pet supplies, whatever items you or your family needs for 24 hours away from home. Keep your gas tank at least half full. Think about how you can brighten someone's day and do it. Purchase an outdoor security camera or system. Don't stress over things you have no control over. Learn what the Bible says about end time events. I like Paul Begley and Perry Stone on YouTube. Enjoy and play with your pet more. Pets can relieve stress and add humor to your day. Try to notice if your family or friends are feeling anxious or worried. You can support each other, especially if they have loved ones in the military. Keep your mind busy. Here are things you can do. Read, listen to positive music, take a class that interests you, work on a hobby or find one, Put together a cheerful puzzle, do crossword puzzles or word searches, play games, videos, cards, musical instruments, whatever it is you enjoy doing to keep your mind busy. Get creative. Write a poem or song. Draw, paint, color. Make a picture DVD or PowerPoint. Create a music CD with uplifting songs. 
Become assertive and prepared, for they are the best ways to help minimize worry. Don't get discouraged. Don't give up on life. Rely on God or your personal faith for strength in getting through these end times. Learn about God because he gives peace and help during troubling times. God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. Psalm 46, 1. For I know my thoughts that I think about you, declares the Lord, thoughts of peace and not harm, to give you a future with hope. Jeremiah 29, 11. Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God your needs and don't forget to thank him for his answers. If you do this, you will experience God's peace, which is far more wonderful than the human mind can understand. His peace will keep your thoughts and your hearts quiet and at rest as you trust in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4, 6 and 7. You will hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that you are not troubled, for all these things must happen, but the end is not yet. Matthew 24, 6. Please like, share, and subscribe to get notification of Gallery of Hope videos.